I was a little disappointed on Saturday, and um, I just want to bring up the importance of having well-plowed streets on the weekends, particularly during the busy ski season, because it projects a good image of Ironwood. So for the next like two weeks, um, get those plows out. <laughs> you can, you know, pop off a little during the week with just the locals around. They do do a very good job. Yeah, and they don't get up for that. when they get out. But, um, <laughs> but especially the, you know, the stormy plumber coming up and the suits of the mm -hmm. want to put a good image for it. I guess the question, what she had um, to say is I'm just kind of wondering the, the staffing plans for the public works because it seems that they are down 46% since 2006. So I don't know what the. Um, sure. You want to give you a quick update on that? We do have a few positions that have not been filled. Um, one of the positions uh, right now, uh, there's been an internal filling of a mechanic position. What we do is we post those internally. Um, internally, the union members get to post to it. Then they have 20 days to decide whether that position is the right position for them from their perspective and from the department's perspective. So we have filled that position internally. That 20 days, I think, was up uh, it's either yesterday or today. So then we have to post the open position there. Again, people post that internally. Then if there is an internal posting, then we have to wait another 20 days. Ultimately, long story short, there should be an opening that we go external to fill. Um, so we'll have that position um, that we're looking at. We just um, received applications. I think the deadline was uh, uh, the 20. Sixth, or was that, uh, I think it was uh, the end of last week actually, for the um, pump station operator equipment to position. So we have applications that just came in for that position. That was an external posting. And we're going to be reviewing those here uh, starting this week and next and then doing interviews for those uh, that position. Um, we just had a recent retirement or have one in, in the process for an open position. Um, again, we're working with the union on that. We're trying to refocus the position a little bit. What we try to do is, with our positions, when an opportunity comes up, someone retires, we look at that position, um, analyze and see if we have to tweak it a little bit. Um, that position is uh, essentially the meter read, uh, excuse me, um, works in, for the water department uh, doing shutoffs for water shutoffs, things like that. Um, what we try to do is create a little more flexibility in the position when they open up. We're looking at uh, basically that position and adding a uh, equipment operator to um, duties to it. And the reason we do that, so if something comes up where we have to utilize that person for other activities, um, we can do that. So we're coordinating with the union on that right now to modify that position a little bit to create some flexibility in it. Instead of having a, kind of a one, um, a real focused position, we try to make them a little more generalized. Um, so that's another <coughs> position. Now once we work through that, then we can post that internally and hopefully fill that internally and then you know, go through the process. Ultimately, have a position that we go external to fill. How many positions are you looking at in the future? Well, that's three right there. Okay. Um, three positions we like to fill. Then we have two positions right now where we have terminations of employees. And those two positions are still there. They're going through an arbitration process. So I guess we'll let the arbitration process determine you know, what occurs with those positions, but that process is, the arbitration process is set up for the union uh, contract. So again, that process, it takes time. I think we have uh, one arbitration in February, and then the other arbitration um, has not yet been scheduled uh, with the arbitrators. So I just looking at the numbers, you know, the public works is down, I think, 13 people. And if they go up to pub, it takes 11, and if we have an have a water leak. Right. Yeah. Yep, we're very tight. we got pretty much everybody on the call schedule right now. Mm -hmm. So we have essentially three positions, and then the two positions that we uh, looked at through arbitration. So total of cost of five positions uh, to bring people back into it. But so it's just the time constraint right now. They're all in the process in different uh, okay. Yeah, it just takes 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 time to get a job.